Hi everyone, my name is Sean Iowa of Crisis Core Organization, and I am the developer and producer of Crisis Core Magazine, the Teaching Post, the Postcard, and the Prophecy Research Journals. I would like to spend a little time introducing the organization and our mission. We apply dedicated research to understanding Bible prophecy within the King James Version Bible, comparing biblical history with the current news of our time. We are a nonprofit organization that brings a visual teaching style of prophecy through illustrations of Scripture. All of Christ's core teachings are inspired from the King James Version Bible, which we believe is the inspired and errant word of God that the Lord has preserved for all of time, as in Psalms 12, 6 through 7. The words of the Lord are pure words, as silver tried in a furnace of earth, purified seven times. Thou shalt keep them, O Lord. Thou shalt preserve them from this generation forever. The foundation of Christ's core organization is based upon Romans 12, 4 through 6, and 2 Corinthians 4, 18. For as we have many members in one body, and all members have not the same office, so we being many are one body in Christ, and every one member one of another, having the gift of fern according to grace that is given to us, whether prophecy, let us prophesize according to a portion of our faith. As stated in Romans 12, there are many offices in the body of Christ, and they are given on the grace of the Lord on the measure of faith. Our organizational mission is to provide readers with a description of how the enemy conceals itself subtly through the things which are not seen or overlooked in our everyday lives, as mentioned in 2 Corinthians 4.18. While we look not at the things which are seen, but at the things which are not seen, for the things which are seen are temporal, but the things which are not seen are eternal. Our magazine takes a detailed look at Bible prophecy and provides readers with the discernment of times through illustrations and Bible scriptures on how the prince of the power of the air works in the children of disobedience. As stated in Ephesians 2.2, 2, Where in times past you walked according to the course of this world, according to the prince of the power of the air, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience. Therefore, you're either on Christ's side or Satan's. You're either saved by the blood of Christ or you're of the spirit of the prince of the power of the air. You're either blessed or cursed, you're either a son of God or a son of Allah. Ending on those words, I would like to thank you for your time. And please don't forget to subscribe to Crisis Core Magazine to get an honest, inspired, prophetic look into scripture. Until we meet again, have a blessed day.